unlike in the U.S., where the debate around fake news is confined to Facebook and Twitter news feeds, in India, the focus is on WhatsApp and growing evidence of messaging platforms being used to spread misinformation, which, according to government officials, in some instances has led to riots and mob lynching across the country. Now, to reduce the threat of fake news, Twitter rolled out a new ad campaigning policy this week across India in an effort to boost transparency. Facebook and WhatsApp have unveiled similar initiatives and are working with third-party organizations to improve fact-checking. But qu experts question whether these policies will be enough. While India has the currently the fastest growing smartphone market in the world, digital literacy is still on the rise, as is awareness around how to distinguish between what's true versus false. Given how close this India election will be, Eurasia's India team says the threat of fake news will continue to be a challenge, putting even more pressure on social media companies to self-police their platforms. Kelly? Seema, thanks. Seema Modi.